Hey everyone, Uncle Jesse here. Let me tell you about how I made over three grand, and that's three grand in profit by selling one 3D print this past week. Yeah, let's also start this as like a two minute 3D tip Tuesday video. I, that naming is horrible there, but I saw something like this from Peter McKenna. I also don't know how to do a timer in one of the corners here, but uh, let's get it started. So if you might know, I like to make some extra income by 3D printing and selling items online. And the latest file that I've been printing and selling is this Ghost by Zao 3D that has hidden feet inside of it that you can actually stand up and pose. And literally over the past week, I have sold over $4,000 worth of these ghosts of people and I've netted hopefully somewhere around $3,000 depending on Etsy fees, shipping fees, as well as the cost of things like filament and other miscellaneous fees. The reason why I'm bringing this up is it's not too late for you to jump in and try and make some extra income by selling these for yourself. Now at the time of recording, I've sold over a hundred of these ghosts and I'm just struggling to keep up with the demand, which is why I'm making this video and sharing it with you guys. And I've continued to sell so many of these that I've had to continually push out my delivery dates, which again is opportunity for folks like yourself to jump in. This is a $10 Patreon file from Zao 3D that I initially saw from It's a Boy in Space over on TikTok, who I know for sure has sold like a bajillion of these and is printing really small keychain variations of them, but there's still lots of opportunity for you to jump in and sell Halloween, this file or other Halloween related things. And here are some tips to consider if you're looking to print these for yourself. I would highly recommend since it's such a simple model to print, there's no supports that are needed for it. I would recommend slapping on a 0.6 millimeter nozzle or even a 0.8 millimeter nozzle, especially if you're planning on printing large variations of this. I've had a number of people reach out to me. I'm printing these currently at 400% scale. If you can print them even larger, there is a market for people willing to pay more for the larger ghosts. So definitely consider that, but maybe consider things like different color variations, rainbow versions, or glow in the dark variations of these. Or if you have a printer that can handle multi colors, you could always consider having different colored shoes or just printing them and painting the shoes and selling them that way. And I'm gonna assume that I've already gone over the two minutes, but I wanted to make this to hopefully help encourage some of you out there that if you have three printers to pick up a file like this or other files that are holiday specific, because right now for the next few months are hugely popular for people wanting to buy unique things online and it's a great opportunity for you out there to make some extra income. And let me know what you think about this new video format. I hopefully will be able to keep up with this knock on wood with different ideas each week, but it's just something fun and different that I can make here for the channel. Hey, thanks so much for watching you guys and I'll see you next time. Bye now.